So on a problem like this, what they say is you have a regular polygon, right? A regular polygon with seven sides. What they want you to do is determine what is the measure of all the interior and the measure of all the exterior angles. All right. So ladies and gentlemen, so far, we know that when we have a regular polygon, we know to find the measure of one angle. We say angle equals the sum of all the interior angles divided by how many sides we have. That's going to tell us the exact measurement of every single angle of my, of my regular polygon. All right. So to do that, I have a equals 7 minus 2 times 180 degrees divided by 7. Make sense? So 5 times 360 is dun, dun, dun. Well, four, I'm sorry, 5 times 180? 900, thank you. So I have A equals 5 times 180, OK? Because 4 times 180 uh, would be 720. So then we have 900 divided by 7. OK? So now I take 900 and divide it by 7. And that's going to be the measure of all of my interior angles. So I do 900 divided by 7. And that means A equals 128.57. So that is going to be the measure of all of my interior angles, is 128 to 128.57 degrees. But then they're asking, what about the measures of the exterior angles? So remember, ladies and gentlemen, it's my horrible regular um, heptagon. But remember, these angles and all these sides are equal to each other. All right. Now remember, we said that all of these are 128.57. Every single angle is 128.57. Now to find the exterior angles, remember what we did to find the exterior angle is we just extend our lines that make up our sides. And then the exterior angle is right here. So the interior angle and the exterior angle form what type of angles? Tommy, do you know? What do we call these angles? They're not so much vertical. Remember, vertical angles come from intersecting two lines. So let's move down the list. So they're not vertical. Guys, let's let them talk. Tommy, let's go through. You can, you're working through it. You're doing all right. Uh, they do up to 180. So what do we call two angles that add up to 180? OK. Just, just, he's doing all right. I'm sorry? They are supplementary. And what type of supplementary angles make up a line and have an adjacent side and vertex? Uh, what type of two angles are supplementary, have an adjacent side and adjacent vertex? We call them a linear, linear pair. Very good. Thank you, Dave. So we don't know what this angle is, though. So it's x. So we can say x plus 128.57 equals 180. Subtract 128.57. Got it right now? Yeah. Oh, OK. Got it. Cool. Got it? Got it. Good. Um, so we need to get 180. So that will be uh, 51.43. Yes? Yeah, I'm assuming. OK, that's it. That's how you find number 39. So then to do the rest of those, you just do the exact same.